Nobody up there's a clear leadership failure which has to be ad ad acknowledged and admitted. You are a member of parliament. Yes. Uh, you, you know, I'm coming. Mm -hmm. You have put your own measures in place to deal with this matter. Mm -hmm. So if the president wanted to fight this head on, you are an MP. You are winning the war in your constituency. Couldn't the president have done something different? Than well, yes, all of us could have done something better including the president. And I acknowledge the fact that uh, we haven't managed the situation as well as uh, we would have thought. And when I say all of us, uh, it is the president's responsibility under the constitution to ensure that the country is governed well. So that one, I agree with you. But it is also our responsibility, even as parliamentarians, to ensure that we also perform to if I call the attention of the president to do that which he ought to do. It is also our responsibility as parliamentarians to ensure that these licenses are not given at random the way it is being done without going through the appropriate laws. It is also our responsibility as um, traditional authorities not to condone and connive with the perpetrators of this crime. It is also our responsibility as community together to ensure that these uh, criminals don't have their way. And it is also our responsibility as a country Ghana to make sure that the laws of the country are respected and obeyed. Mm. Uh, having said all that, I think the president is also coming out with, uh, albeit uh, late, with solution mechanisms. And uh, I also see some videos of politicians uh, taking positions that are, uh, are confusing. Uh, no, I mean, they're unnecessary. Oh, unnecessary. Very unnecessary I and mean. confusing. But I agree with my brother who says that it is a national fight. I see, in fact, we are not agitating for a ban on um, mining. Let's get that one straight. We are not agitating because necessarily the minerals of the country ought to be mined responsibly and legally. But uh, what we are saying is that mining in the forest areas and the law, we have all attacked the law, and I'm sure that it will be mm. annulled soon. But, but, but in the water bodies, mm. there can't be any compromise. So whatever, I see people in the water bodies. Forest reserves. Mm. I, yes. I keep saying that, but that there's forest reserves. I said that, saying, listen, listen, I said that I know that the law will be repealed pretty soon, yeah. because all of us are you in see, agreement you, you, as to you, you, the repeal of the law. That, that LI-2462, mm -hmm. what, what was running through the minds of the MPs? who approved this in parliament. Mm -hmm. you, 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 is it one of the bills that see, came no, in on the no, no, last no, no. day? Let's explain. You let's and then you no, no, no. It. Let's explain this. We'll, we'll get there and explain. And indeed, we must also accept culpability for not being that vigilant at that point. But let's, when we get there, we'll, we'll, we'll talk about it again and talk about the, in the, uh, the absence of independence in the House. Mm -hmm. You see, the parliament and all parliaments from the the fourth republic up to now they are all not independent because we have a parliamentary system that calls for creeping of parliaments into uh, members into positions that must go away parliament must be parliament as an independent institution so that anything comes to us we as parliamentarians will add value to what is there not be creeped into taking a position that is almost like the position of the executive it is wrong it comes because Leadership of parliament is selected by the executive. Yeah. And when such persons are selected, they are doing their master's bid. Let parliamentarians elect our own leaders so that we will stand as parliament and be able to vet whatever comes from the executive. And that we will collectively act to protect the people of Ghana. But mm. the way it is, uh, you blame parliamentarians, but it is the system. Wow. And again, going forward, I will advocate that our constitution is sick. Let's cure it. A constitution that consolidates power into one person's hand cannot be a good constitution. Yeah. And indeed, everybody who goes to law school, the first thing you will learn is constitutionalism. Constitutionalism is simply distribution of power, not aggregation of power into a center. That is wrong. So this, our constitution is sick. I hear people talk about constitutional review, and they're talking about even um, um, uh, bringing the presidential term into uh, some situation where somebody can, you see, 
let's be bold and say that this constitution uh, executive presidency hasn't served as well as Ghanaians. And therefore, any African who has absolute authority to do anything becomes despotic. You are 100% right. And so. therefore, let's work on that. I have talked about the law, I've talked about the constitution, the provisions, I've talked about well, parliament, the independence. For eight years. I've talked about, have about listen, the of the constitution. I've talked about, listen, I've talked about even the core constitution. Yes. And I've talked about it, an attempt to review the constitution. And they are wrong in looking at wrong areas. Okay. The major area that looks to be that needs to be looked at is the presidency itself. Exactly. But that's the heart and, of the and, and unfortunately point. we are not even addressing our minds to that. All right. And any one of us who will say this, you are always in trouble. I know that I'm in trouble, but I don't mind. Well, uh, and, and God bless you. God bless you. You're a good man. You see, you've been so, my president for so, me. So 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 for now, let us all act as Ghanaians. The thing that confronts us is war. If I, in a war situation, we don't look at relationships. We look at how to solve, to save the country. And we are there, there now at a war front. And let not anybody attempt to take credit for where credit is not due. And let's all see ourselves as facing danger. And let's fight together and win the war. Thank and you. The, and the Apiakobe is member of Parliament. Mm -hmm.